Hi there, sign of Gemini. This is Kim with Just Say and Tarot and Oracle, and this is your message for Timeless. So it's for whenever. It's for whenever it resonates with you. It's a bonus, a thank you for me for uh, your likes, your shares, subscribes. Struggling to overcome self-imposed limiting beliefs. This can be anything from trying to fit yourself into a role or define yourself by other people's standards. You know what I mean? Um, even setting something high is still setting something. So any kind of limiting belief, anything that puts you in a category or boxes out any other possibilities is what it's talking about. Fighting to emotionally detach and not winning. This is almost like trying to eight of cups, but not being able to. Sunflower, bright future, happy days. Spiritual work and self-discovery. <laughs> this might be about your self-discovery. Ball of yarn, unravel, complicated, or to string along. Hope not. And there's going to be a need to step out of your comfort zone in order to accomplish something here. I feel like it's what it's talking about. Like in order to accomplish something, um, you're going to one, have to believe that you can do it. And two, just put your mind to it. Focus the intent. That's where, where the power goes. That's what creates where your intention is. Ten of swords. Gosh, because you're walking away from something. You're what? He's like, peace. You're walking away from something because somebody's hurt you like for the last time. This is a situation that really has made you upset or angered you. King of Cups in the reverse. So uh, it's kind of hard to maintain um, emotions at this time. Like th they would be running really high at this time. Jeez. Okay, Gemini. Uh, <laughs> the Tower. So not only has this made you upset, but it's sudden. And it's coming with sudden abrupt change too. I feel like you need to get the whole truth. So there's some more truth to, there's something that you're not hearing completely. Like there's something that's not being 100% truthful or someone that's not being 100% truthful with you. And it's causing this tower moment. I feel like the Knight of Wands is telling me that like you've always been there. Maybe it's moving quickly. This person's gone in and out of your life, but Here's the thing with the lovers in reverse. I feel like maybe you're getting out of one situation, moving towards something different. The lovers is feeling like, uh, in the reverse, is feeling like somebody made a bad decision. King of Wands could be Leo energy or just um, inspirational, like this is moving you into a good direction. Healing family issues and soulmate stuff, soulmate energy. And Ten of Pentacles. At the end of the day, look, divine timing with temperance. At the end of the day, this energy that you're pulling in for yourself is going to bring you a lasting fulfillment and family legacy, prosperity, solving, mending some issues here. Tell me about the Six of Cups. But I, but I do feel like you have to step out of your comfort zone in order to walk away from something. 10-10, ten, ten, um, also with the temperance, that's, you know, 10-10 ten, ten, ten is um, patience. Elder of Pentacles, maybe a King of Pentacles energy, might be about a Taurus energy. Oh, down here, right? So it might have to do with the money situation and it might be about like family business because something ends up doing really good here. What's this lovers in reverse about? Five of Pentacles. Somebody made you feel like you were left out or in the cold. Well, I'm telling you, you're going from a situation where the contrast is going to be amazing because it's going from hurting, feeling left out, ignored, either ghosted or um, somebody just made a decision that led to 
this really big worrisome time. Maybe somebody's health, you know, five of pentacles can be about health. It can be about anything in the material realm that we're really worried about. Tell me about the page of swords in the reverse. Tell me about the page of swords in the reverse. The moon, something still okay with this with this complicated and string along makes me feel like there's something still really unknown to you there's more information that you don't have yet that's going to be made known to you and it's going to be gosh disappointing in this person nine nine it's going to cause you to take a look at uh where your thing where your life is going changing your thinking and moving away from a situation i feel going towards something that's actually going to work uh, what about this Ten of Swords? Yeah, it, it, some of you are going through a breakup. Some of you are just making a big move, like a move, literally. Um, judgment is what's being kind of in the balance. So some of you are accepting somebody back. Some of you are wanting a fresh new start. And uh, this is just representing not, you know, holding any judgments on anything that you see. Or that you do like don't judge your own experience what you're going through is meaningful even if it's um, hard right especially if it's hard things grow in dirt <laughs> so meaning it this dirty situation you're gonna grow a lot from right king of cups Justice in the reverse, the tower. That what makes you mad is this injustice. Jeez, Libra energy, tower energy, guy. You all have um, kind of serious reading. Let's just get some different cards. Let's see what else comes out. What other messages do you have for Gemini? Let's cheer them up a little bit. Goodness, Canary spirit, sing your own song. Wombat spirit, be at home. And then there is something about trusting the way that things are going because it is leading towards a healing and towards lasting prosperity, rich wealth, well spirit. Trust the great mystery. Trust that this is like a divine, divine detour. Elephant spirit. Learn from the past and going forward, it's going to lead to like wise investments and something that it feels like a business or something within the family structure that really blossoms and blooms. And it may be you, like this King of Wands energy, feeling uh, very inspirational to others or looking very inspirational to others. Turtle spirit, slow and steady wins the race here on the bottom. Let's get some angel number messages for you, Gemini. Ooh, 777, seven, seven. you're in the flow. There may be a challenge because it's a seven, but you're in the flow. This is the challenge here, the five of pentacle energy, which let me tell you, you come out of. 777, seven, seven. your purpose flows from within you and everything that's unfolding or being revealed to you is part of your purpose. A state of peace and calmness in your soul. I am in the flow. And then 24 is about you having a heart of gold, being the nurturer, protector, and provider, kind of like all at once here. Let's pull something from the Guardian Angel reading cards. I feel like that might help. Angel of past lives. Yeah, this is a past life issue. Angel of communication. There's another seven. Seven, 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 seven angel of past lives and it was laying on the king of wands and the ten of pentacles virgo and leo energy possibly 24 angel of past lives ah and then i have angel of comfort your angels are here ready to comfort you also telling you the message 6 12 is 6 6 6 6 6 is about a uh, balance and and then you needing to i feel like restore your faith have some more trust in your situation and where you're going and know that you are being guided somewhere safe. I think that's important to say is that where you're being guided is somewhere safe. Okay, Gemini. We're going to do some timing cards after this. This is a Martian Oracle. The golden ratio. Oh, patterns. <laughs> yeah, once you notice your patterns, what is repeating? kind of patterns are repeating in your life because that's what it's trying to tell you about 
13 um, men in black look you are what pattern is happening is you are mirroring some of your issues like somebody else their their things their problem your problems you have with them are actually a mirror of your own issues here 13 men in black stalking intimidation confrontation that's the mirroring and then two alpha centurions foresight planning and strategy all right, so there's planning and strategy that's needed here. And um, yeah, and one, two, three, and four. You can choose one for the timing of your situation. One, eight months, two, three days. Three, this is happening very quickly. And four, two months. That's what I got for you. Sending you love and light. Bye, Gemini.